The Aperture Spotlight Max is a projection lens with Bowens mount that is available with a 19 degrees, 36 degrees and 50 degrees front lens aimed at cinematographers and video professionals. The unit can also be used with A and B sized gobos to beam specific light shapes and a dedicated ETC adapter. For our tests we used the 19 degrees kit with a Lightstorm 600X Pro by Colorlight. According to Aperture the lens should project a very clean outline with little to no light spill or heavy fringing on the edges of the circle or shape. Even though we haven't directly compared the Max to similar products from other brands the results look indeed very pleasing. While there are many reasons to use a spotlight, for our needs on commercial productions the GoWars are just as useful since they allow for more variation in a scene. The kit comes in a robust big black case with wheels which honestly is essential since the whole setup is rather heavy. The Spotlight Max has a heavy duty removable yoke that features a 28mm spigot which is compatible with professional light stands. The spigot is needed for a safe setup since the kit alone weighs over 12 kilos plus an additional 5 kilos from the Alice 600X Pro. The light itself doesn't need to be supported with a second tripod since the Spotlight Max is heavier. For bigger and heavier lights it could make sense to put the light on a stand rather than the Spotlight Max and remove the yoke entirely. There is a locking handle on each side which makes it possible to adjust the tilt smoothly and lock it at a specific angle without any additional movement. When I first got the Spotlight Max I wasn't sure if I would be able to use it immediately without a proper introduction but as it turns out the setup and operation is rather easy to handle even for a solo operator. There are four rotatable and movable shutters that can each open and close a side of the light output. This means it's possible to switch from a perfectly round circle to a square or control the light output in any way. In front of the shutters is a compartment for filters such as gobos that need to be inserted into a dedicated holder first. This clip features a gearing that can be rotated to adjust the angle of the shape after being inserted which can save quite some time. Due to the gear it's even possible to attach a motor and utilize the rotation as a creative effect during filming. The red knobs on the bottom and the right side need to be loosened to adjust the lens extension for focusing. This is the only function that needs some time to adjust since precise focus is essential and one of the main reasons to consider using this device. When it comes to sharpness and distortion the results with a 19 degrees lens in combination with the LS 600X Pro can have slightly different outcomes depending on distance. The overall sharpness is well maintained with some green and magenta fringing towards the edges of the shape. Chromatic aberrations are more noticeable at daylight color temperatures than at very warm Kelvin values. Keep in mind that these are just my observations and there are many variables such as angle, output and of course the light performance. The maximum light output we measured at 5600K at a distance of 5 meters was 3000 lux and 1400 lux when setting the color temperature to 3200K. Although the Spotlight Max surely is a workhorse meant to be used on bigger productions with plenty of ways to customize the look and shape, a large crew is not necessarily needed to operate the setup. <laughs> 